Hey guys, my name is Jeeps here. Today, I'll be showing you everything you could do with the event receiver. There's so much you could do with this chip, such as when a player joined, do this. When a player joined, do that. When a player left, do this. When a player left, do that. And so much more. So today, I'll be showing you what and how you could do with this. First thing you wanna do is look at the top of your maker pen and you should get this menu. You want to click configure, then configure the event receiver. Once you have done that, you should get this new menu. And as you can see, it says event right there and a little pop down. You want to click little pop down. And here's all the settings you could do. You could do consumable use, player joint, player left, room loaded, room reset, test event, update 30 hertz. For this tutorial, I'm going to do room loaded. And now that we did that, we have a whole completely new chip, which says event receiver, room loaded. But whatever you picked is what it will say right after event receiver. Now, because we got this, I think we're gonna say maybe when the room is loaded, somebody spawns in a seat. The way to connect it when the room is loaded, it seats the player, is open up your Maker Man, go to connect, and you want to connect the EXEC to seat player. And it's as simple as that. Now, if I save the room, I spawn right here inside the seat. You can't see me because I'm behind the circuit board, but I spawned inside the seat. You could also do it when the room is loaded. It could play an audio. And to do that, you just got to get your audio player and your sample audio consonant. Configure your sample audio by opening back up in your maker pen and going to configure. Once done, it has chip settings. Drop down that drop down. Edit sample. And you could just record anything. Say music or maybe your own voice. So, uh, yeah, it's recording right now. So, check, check, tutorial, tutorial. Yeah. Click stop. And you could preview oh, uh, it. Yeah, it's recording right now. So check, check, uh, you can clear if you did it wrong or messed up. Uh, and then once you're done and you got it correct, click save. Now that we did that, we could wire the EXEC to play on the auto player circuit board. We also want to go to sample audio and wire the audio knob to the other audio knob on the audio player circuit board. Now that we have done that, we could save the room again. So, uh, yeah, and it's recording plays. right now. So, check, check, tutorial, tutorial. Yeah. Pretty cool, huh? That's not it. You could do so much more with this little chip right here. The event receiver. It is crazy. If this video helped you, make sure to like and subscribe. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.